Thank you, Serona. You be well. Now, what can I... Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Is it? Is it just me or her Heard voice about a little the attack. deep? I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one, single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. I will say, <sighs> trolls in Hogsmeade, that's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with. Uh, 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 not timely. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Sarona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said, my friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, the Theophilus. The Three Broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butterbeer forever. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls, Ranrock, and Rookwood. What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. All right, guys. I think that now might be a good time to head back to the castle. All right, guys. We jump right into a cutscene, but I want to say thank you guys for coming back. I appreciate you guys for coming back and being patient. Uh, yes, we fought a troll, but something happened with my setup here. Um, it didn't record how I wanted it to record, and I don't want to put out any bad product so i appreciate you guys for being patient uh any any other fights i can't wait to to fight them with you guys uh let's get into it let's get into it it says down at the bottom left it says talk to natty outside of three broomsticks let's go it's a little dark in here I am certainly glad Serona was there. And that she isn't intimidated by thugs like Brookwood and Harlow. I want to understand what's going on, and I hope you will tell me. But for the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley will certainly hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. I don't want her to worry. You must return to the common room for the night. Access the map. All right, let's access it. Let's go to our... I'll come in room, select the Hogwarts map button to switch to Hogwarts map. Alright, so let's highlight and switch. Uh, fast travel to your common room. I'm assuming this one's it. And this one. It's Ravenclaw common room. Travel. Again, I just want to say I appreciate you guys for being so patient. I'm new to YouTube. I'm new to this setup. Um, I'm trying to figure out what's going to be right for for me to give y'all the best quality audio, the the best um, graphics. I just appreciate you guys. But hey, we back. We back and we going. All right. It says new quest available. Let's read the mail. It said you have received the owl post. Let's open field guide. We got some mail from Professor Fig. Hey, this is our guy. 
Remember in, 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 in episode one when he really had our back? He really saved us a bunch of times. He says, come and see me. I've discovered something in the locket we found at Grinots. Grinots. Gringots. All right, we're going to meet Professor Fig. He says, talk to Professor Fig. Let's. This little thing, if I push up on the arrow, it tell me where I got to go. So that's really handy. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Rebellion. This game looks awesome, by the way. I know I said about this the fourth episode. I, I'm just amazed by it. By the way. My boy pretty fast, I'm not gonna lie. What is this? Tomato plants? Oh no, them look poisonous. Jesus, how far is Professor Fig? All right, let's go. We probably could have fast traveled, but ah, there go our fast travel point. For now on, we can go there and fast travel. All right, so let's go in this room. Collection and swirl. Pick up. Professor Fig, as if my schedule wasn't congested enough, the ministry has charged me with arranging the rather inconvenient arrival of the new student at Hogwarts. A fifth year, if you can believe, Professor Weasley insists that they will need an escort and a mentor to help them. Kim, what does it say? I really can't read that in cursor before the turns begin. I have assigned the task to you. Please see Professor Weasley for details. Professor Phineas, Black Headmaster. That was the letter that I'm assuming Professor Fig got. Oh, we just sat down and waited for, for Professor Fig. Professor, Fig. I'm glad to see you. And I, you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. It had that dark glow like the dragon collar. Goblin silver. Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to... They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was in Hogsmeade with Rookwood. The trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me, and he would have had Serona and the patrons at the Three Broomsticks not intervened. This is grave news indeed. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. Hmm, sir, about the goblins, all right. Speaking of the vault, do you think that Ranrock is working with any of the goblins at Gringotts? I do not. Gringotts goblins aren't typically the friendliest of beings, but they have a great deal of integrity. No, I dare say after what happened to that poor banker, the goblins at Gringotts are no followers of Ranrock. They're after the locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's That's... a map of Hogwarts, to be sure, but I do not know where it leads. It leads to the library. A restricted section, to be precise, and a bit beyond. 
I see traces of magic there on the map. I suspected you would see something. Shall we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Hecate a bit before we continue. But sir, how dangerous could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book, but we should be prepared for anything. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. I'll let Professor Hecate know to expect you. Ah, uh, yeah. Revelio. The reason I keep knowing Revelio is for this reason here. It be it, it highlights some of the treasures that we may miss sometimes. So we got a French forest lock scarf. All right, let's check our let's check our inventory. Let me see. Let's look at our gear real quick. Boom. Cause I know we got some new stuff. So right now we're rocking the Crimson Quidditch gloves. It gives us four offense. Okay, we only got glasses right now. Headwear. That's our headwear, the dark flat cap. <laughs> we're just really putting on any, anything we find that's new and better, we're gonna put it on, guys. We're gonna have a new look almost every episode. So, this has four, uh, five offense, and this has five offense. This has the fringe. Hmm. Can I upgrade that one? You can't upgrade this one. So, we're going to keep this one because you can upgrade it. Let's see about our cloak. Do we got anything new? Right now, we have this one. Have five offense, zero offense. And four. We can sell these two whenever we get a chance. Let's look at our outfits. Yeah, we only got one outfit, so. Oh, this here is highlighted, so let's. Okay, we, we already read that, so we're not going to view it. The gear. We got some more stuff in the gear. Oh, our wand. So this is the wand I chose, guys. It's a swirl, dark gray wand handles. An unconventional twisted handle designed in gray and silver. I think it's a pretty dope one. The wood type is maple. The core type is phoenix feather. Flexibility is pliant. The one length is 11 because I feel like that's my lucky number. All right, let's get it. Let's go back to the story. Oh, wait, what's this? Challenges? Field guide pages. Got some stuff here. Claim rewards. Okay, we got some glasses. We got some new glasses here. All right, let's go check out these new glasses really quick. Oh no, we didn't. We, that was just collectibles. Collection. See here. Those glasses should be in here now. Okay, cool. It sucks. I wish we can kind of actually wear what we win. <laughs> All right, so we out of here, y'all. I should come back to this another time. Yes. It says report to Fester Hellcat. Hellcat. Rebellion. Anything in here? Hmm. Nothing in here. All right. Oh, there is oh, something nice in here. To see you, my young friend. Hmm. I'm curious. Maybe something maybe something to fly out. Like a piece like a page. Oh, Yo, that's crazy. 
Rebellion. Is this, is this a chess? Oh, we can. We can. Uh. Akio. Can we open this? Preparer. Levioso. Lumos. Ah, this won't open. I don't know why. I wish. All right. So let's go. Let's go. We'll come back to that. We'll get it later. All right. Let's go. Rebellion. I don't see anything in here right now. Let go a cat. All right, let's go. Y'all, I'm so excited. I'm glad you guys chose this channel to to watch me play. I appreciate it so much, and I love the feedback. Wait, let's talk to her really quick. Help me. Are you all right? Don't you know who I am? Zenobia Noak, the girl whom everyone at school hates for no reason. Everyone hates you? Why? Because Hogwarts is full of bullies and spoil sports. Leander Pruitt's one of the worst, that no talent moon mind. I wanted to make some new friends, and so I brought my collection down to the common room. My gobstone collection, that is. I was hoping someone would want to play. Are you familiar with gobstones? Little balls, like marbles. Grand game. And if you lose, they spray you with a foul-smelling liquid. Oh no, that sounds awful. I haven't much interest in a game that sprays you with odors. Only if you lose, which I never do. Or at least, not often. <sighs> People can be so cruel. Just because they're sprayed all over with smelly gobstone spit, it's their own fault Y'all think we should play? Thing. Y'all think we should play? Imelda is one of the worst losers. Everett and Astoria are terrible as well. And now those poor losers have taken my gobstones and hidden them in very high places all over the school. Rather an overreaction on their part. I'll say. Anyway, I can't work out how to get them back on my own. I don't think I know the necessary spells yet. I need someone... Perhaps a selfless and talented fifth year to help me. Sounds like us. <laughs> um, any idea how to reach them? You don't have any friends? Nah, we're just gonna cut I'll to the chase. Can do. We know. I'd we know we got a help. helper. If you do find all of my gobstones, do come and see me again. I'll be back to playing Snake Pit and Jackstone by myself in no time. All right, guys, keep a keep a lookout for the gobstones. That's a quest, a side quest. All right, let's go. Back to, back to here. I love this thing. It tell you where to go. It saves a lot of time. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. How would you? Oh, there got one. Hmm. Akio. Well, that's one of Zenobia's gobstones. Uh... I hardly see what all the fuss is about. Cool. Let's go. Y'all remember this from episode one? This looked a little creepy, huh? That is creepy. And then they got the music playing in the background. That's... There's something in there. I just know it. Hello. I don't believe we've met. Oh, hello. I'm Lenora. Pardon me if I seem a little distracted at the moment. Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. Hmm, have you learned anything about it? Better paintings like it. We know. Are there any other empty paintings? There's like other paintings. School? Yes, a few. This entire place is somewhat of a riddle, to be honest. If I can work out the riddle of this one, I'll know what to do with all of them. As good a place as any to begin. Have you gained any insights about the painting since you've been studying it? I did discover that casting Lumos has an effect of some kind. Oh. But I'm not sure what to do next. 
Okay. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. <sighs> I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. We're not gonna do them yet, but do come and find me if you we're gonna definitely. Illuminating that solves the mystery. Hello, Lenora. Could you remind me what's so special about that empty painting? It's not necessarily special, as far as I can tell. It's some sort of puzzle that I'm trying to work out. Have a look if you're of a mind. Perhaps you can spot a clue that I've missed. All right, so let's see. Let's do Lumos. Lumos. Okay. That spot must be a clue. Where is this spot? Around in case it's nearby. Okay, that spot. It looks like it's downstairs. It looks like it's downstairs right here somewhere. Hmm. It looks like it's on either one of these sides here. Y'all heard that? Hmm. So if you look like this, tell me, tell me this don't look like. All right, so this staircase got red on it. Yeah, that is down there. All right, so cool, right here. Right here. It's right here. Lumos. Cause look, boom. It's just like this. But I don't know what to do right here. Mm. What do y'all think? All right, so. Lumos. I don't know. All right, cool. We just we're gonna come back to it eventually. We, eventually, we're gonna get it. Let's see to the story. Let's Ready? get you back to your frame, little moth. Oh, there we found it. I should tell the Nora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. Ah, uh, now where's Lenora? The boys don't make it any easier. She's right. Revelio, accurate. Yeah, I saw another. I saw another. Boom. Is this her? Where's Lenora, y'all? She went upstairs, did she? Lenora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? I found the location depicted in the painting and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. Pity I was so close to solving it. You have a knack for solving riddles. Natty's good at that too. So is Amit, although he does tend to over-explain. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. Cool. I should have seen that. We're almost at level five. I'm excited. All right, so let's look up um, the quest. No, not inventory quest. Oh, right here. Boom. And it says. Boom. All right, cool. Watch out. It's the troll slayer of Hogsmeade. Oh, you talk about us. We kind of, I ain't gonna lie. We, we kicked their butt. Oh, wait. Rebellion. There's some treasure in here. Gotta figure out how to get in there, though.
Is it locked? Revelio. Okay. This. It says 1721. It has. Okay. 1721. Hmm. Alright, so. It has that. That one. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. And it's the owl. No, because we just did the owl. All right. All right, so 11. Okay, oh, okay, I get it, I get it. I think I get it. 11, 21. All right, I don't get it. All right, cool. We're gonna go to that later. <laughs> hey, let's even, let's just try to go somewhere else. All right. Oh, it worked. It's not working. All right, no. I tried to cheat. It didn't work. All right, let's go, guys. Hello, Zenobia. What did you need help with? I need someone to collect my gobstones that have okay, been hidden I thought we can give her the one that we found. The school. All right, cool. We'll come back to you later, man. Rebellion. Let me just see what's in here. Okay. Oh, wait. Something's back here. It's ah, like a, it's a lock. I believe we have some matters to discuss. Level two lock. We gotta work on getting. Gotta work on getting some some lock picking skills. I'm here about the new spell you wanted to teach me, Professor. Good. Uh, Professor Fig indicated a certain urgency to you completing your defensive magic assignments. As such, you are to learn Incendio, the fire-making spell. Handy for lighting torches, burning away spider webs, and, when necessary, defending against those who would wish to do us harm. Sounds uh, versatile. Quite. But before we get started, I'd like you to complete a few tasks. You may be surprised by some of them. Astonishing how much students don't think their professors know. When you're finished, come and see me. Then we shall begin working on Incendio. Okay. You know where to find me once you've finished. Cool. I know where to find you. Seems crossed wands isn't as secret as it's believed to be. That thing is weird. It's watching me. You see it? Oh, okay. Let's get up out of here. Oh, wait. What was that? Oh. Oh, this is cool. Look at this bridge. That's crazy. This place is huge, y'all. Level two. Okay, I got level one. Whee! Whoa! Huh? Oh, not again. Here I've come from the toilet bowl where she said I could what? swim. Did you practice a mole? As long as we're only one time per week, I can plunge the boy's lavatory. Not for the meek. He's That's crazy. Me I guarantee you won't meet him later. Rebellion. Anything in here? Nah. Oh, okay, what's this? Lumos. Reparo. Akio. Akio. Levioso. Repairer. 
Hmm, I wonder. That thing up there is highlighted. We, we're probably going to learn something right now to deal with that. Glad you could make it. Lucan's just oh. over there. Rebellion. Repair her. Leviosa. Ah. Uh. Accio. We are level five, right? Not yet. Rebellion. Anything else in here? It's a lot of locks. We can't get can in. Help you? Yeah, sure. You can help me, bro. Can I help you? Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinated duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. I don't take him down a pig. I, 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 I did take him down a pig. Um, that, that's nice to hear. Let's be nice. Let's be nice. I'm flattered to hear that. Sebastian's not a bad duelist either. Imagine it's quite something to see the two of you duel. How does cross ones work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Yeah, heck yeah. Of course, dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Let's Besides, kick his butt. In cross ones, a little kid. you can duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Let's go. Get me in the ring. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! We're gonna mess him up, y'all. We'll make you regret signing up. Okay. Initiate round. Uh, block through yellow shield with control spells like Levioso. Okay. Uh, target lock as you track enemies without aiming. Hmm. Okay. Luma. You're better than that. Fringo. I'm the one. Protego. Stupid. Come on. Stupid. It's also. Now we're messing them up. Alright, we won. Easy. What to do? Nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. In fact, the second duel is ready when you are. And as a fully initiated member, you now have access to the official Crossed Ones training dummy. Very good way to master spell combinations. Come and see me and I'll set it up. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. All right, cool. We're in a fight club. Special level five. All right, let's talk to him again. No, no, no. Meet Professor Hellcat. All right, cool. Yeah, I want to try to let's fast travel. Off on another adventure, are we? Oh. Hmm. Map. We need to go right here. Hmm. 
Hmm, we can't we can't go there, huh? Alright, cool. We're not gonna worry about it. We can just go there. We can walk there. I feel sorry for your next opponent. Just wait till I've grown a bit. Then we'll see how well you do. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Y'all say so. I'm not gonna lie. I am a... We are a good wizard over here. Mastering all type of stuff. Thing. I don't think I'm ready for this just yet. Oh. What? So, hmm. Alright. So, we have to go to and do the next thing. Ah. We gotta do round two. Alright, let's go do round two. Whenever we get time, I'm going to learn how to fast travel really quick. For another round? I right. think so. We shall see who shows up. There's no one in the school I'd be afraid to duel. Hello, Lucan. May I use the training dummy? Of course. I'll fetch it and give you a list of combinations to practice. Ready to have a try now? Yeah, let's go. That would be wonderful. Be sure to cast all your spells before the dummy lands. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. Alright, so cast Accio. Accio? Let me race it. Oh, oh. Wow. Protego! Next time, oh. pass! Accio! Oh. That's it! Let me race it. Done. Let me go. Akio. Good one. I'd say that's enough practice. You looked good out there. Thank you, Lucan. I say better to discover one's weaknesses during practice than during a duel. You'll be a fearsome challenger now. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Let's, let's see what else is on the quest. Because I believe it was another one. It says Professor Hellcat Assignment 1. It says complete a. What? Complete a round of spell combination practice with. Hmm. Rear round 2 of cross. Okay, we gotta. We gotta battle him again. Hello, Lucan. 
Is the next round of crossed ones all set? Why, yes it is. I've got a great match lined up. Ready for another round? Mm-hmm. I'm ready. Let's do it. We're going to try to use those exact combos. Uh, let's do Sebastian. Yes, Sebastian. Then let's get to it. Ready to get thrashed? Apologies in advance. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Three of them. Bravo! I gave it my all. You did indeed. The other duelists have already taken notice of you, but after that last round, they'll really have it in for you. You'd better keep practicing if you want a chance at winning, <laughs> or at least surviving the next round. I'll let you know when we're ready. Hope to see you then. The next round is for all the gobstones, so to speak. Rebellion. Assignments all finished. All right, assignments all finished. Let's go. Let's see if we can fast travel. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I don't know how to I'm activate most this. Honestly, to be included. Accio, Levioso, Reparo. Hmm. Maybe we just look on the map and let's try to zoom in. We're here. Oh, and then we just go here, and then we just travel. Easy, cool, got it. And yeah, we is we is moving in this game. We just beat up a look some little kids. I bet you can on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. I trust Mr. Brattleby was able to... I finished all of the tasks you gave me, Professor Hackett. Glad to hear it. Then you should be ready to learn Incendio. Should be, Professor. Yes. I'm sorry to say I visited enough careless colleagues at St. Mungo's to assure you that Fire is a fickle servant. Your spellcasting has impressed me thus far, but please maintain focus. I would rather we not end today's lesson with your robes aflame. Let us begin. And remember, focus on the proper wand movement. All right, let's get this down. Concentrate Act. and keep your wand X steady. Square. X. Oh, this direction, X again. Easy. Um, we want to replace Reparo because that's not a yeah, we're gonna replace Reparo if we can. 
So hold R2 to assign. Um, yeah. Okay, cool. So let's go back. Incendio is a heavy damage spell that unleashes destructive flames at a short at a short range. Rebellion. Okay, we just learned it though. Oh snap! So let's let's try Incendio. it out. Incendio, getting it. Keep at it. Akio, try not to incinerate yourself. Incendio. Levioso. Cool. All right, cool. We got it. We got it down packed. We can mess up somebody now, y'all. <laughs> All right. Revelio. Also, we got to keep. Oh, there goes something up there. Let's see if we can grab it real quick. It was right. I saw it down there, y'all. Oh, right there. So you gotta go up one more. And now let's see if we can. It may be locked. Rebellion. Should be here and here. Okay, we got a scarf. There's another one in here somewhere. Is this? The... Oh, what is this? We're just gonna flush all these over again. Oh, all right, cool. Revelio. All right, let's go, y'all. We out, we out. Oh, I broke some. All right, let's go. Let's wait. Ah, there you are. Hello, sir. You'll be pleased to know that I worked on my defensive magic with Professor Heckard. So I hear. She tells me you've taken rather well to your new wand. You must continue to work with her and your other professors to improve your skills. That said, I don't wish to postpone our visit to the library any longer. So, yeah, we shall gotta we go proceed? to the library. We have to. Fig! I have work for you. Come. Headmaster, I'm with a student and my schedule Your is... schedule will wait indefinitely, as will your student. I would think that after all the trouble you caused me with Osric, you'd be eager to make amends. My office. Five minutes. I don't like Professor Black, man. He is... He's mean, man. That man is exasperating. Unfortunately, our trip to the restricted section will have to wait a bit longer. But, Professor, we have no choice. It would be unwise to provoke our illustrious headmaster further. I shall find you when I've completed whatever toils I must endure. Okay, cool. We'll, we'll be back. I'm just trying to look up, because I know... Sebastian mentioned sneaking into the restricted section. Perhaps he'll have an idea. Yo, we gotta go to Sebastian, you think? All right, let's let's see if we can fast travel.
Let's get it, y'all. Cool. Talk to Sebastian. Hello there. Perhaps you can help me. Hello? Were you calling me? I was, yes. Thought you might be interested in joining me for a bit of an adventure. Following mm. a treasure map, to be precise. Slight respite from battling the odd troll, I should think. Asked Poppy if she'd be interested as well, but couldn't drag her away from her puff skein. I found two maps lying about, both leading to locations around Hogwarts. Care to have a look at one? Mm. Yeah, we should we should Following do it real quick. Before we get map, into the main juicy stuff, let's Wonderful. go and do some side Hogwarts side missions me. real quick. You can keep whatever treasure lies at the end of your map. I'll be satisfied just knowing where it leads. We might find something cool. Very well. I shall take a look if I can find the time. Fair enough. Meet me back here if you find anything. Okay, cool. Ah, so this is... Hmm, this don't look familiar. Alright, cool. We got a map. We'll keep it. Until then... Let's go in here. Find the landmark of Rebellion. Hmm. The landmark. Oh wait. Professor, do you have time to chat? I always have time for my students. How may I help you? I wondered if I might ask how long you've been teaching at Hogwarts. Well, it's been what now? <laughs> Seven swift years. Time does fly because we have fun. Essential in my opinion. An eager, positive and confident mind is the most open to knowledge, I find. Some of the professors may not agree with your approach. <laughs> well, each of us has our own style, I suppose. Some in the teaching field believe that hard work and dedication are the only keys to success. But they forget what drives those things. If one cannot fathom why some would expend energy on gobstones, then one is blind to the enormous power of play. And that's why you teach the way you do? Precisely. I strive to be the sort of professor that I would have enjoyed in school. My experience was less cheerful. Perhaps you wouldn't be who you are without that experience. Had I received a more traditional education? Well, enough about my student days. You are here now, and it would be a shame if you didn't enjoy it. I'll do my best, Professor. Thank you for the advice. You are most welcome. <laughs> Try to have a bit of fun today. <laughs> oh yeah, we're gonna have fun. We got a little treasure map. Uh... The first clue shows a rhinoceros skeleton on display. I know I must have walked by it at least a dozen times now. If only I could remember where where it is. Hmm. Y'all keep a, a a lookout for a, a rhinoceros skeleton. I thought I remember. Hmm. Rhinoceros skeleton. All right, let's try upstairs. They gotta be upstairs. Hmm. Lumos. Akio. Leviosa. There's another one of these d dang on doors. Hmm. They call it 
It has to be. Let's see if it may be here. All right, not super skeleton. Lumos. Oh, there, look, y'all, look. Akio. There goes a skeleton. That's a skeleton there, right? All right, so let's let's switch to uh, Repero. All right. Repero. Nah, that does nothing. All right, so let's switch back. Okay. I don't know, but that's that's it right there. Oh, right here. No, that's not a rhinoceros skeleton. But we're close. Sebastian mentioned sneaking into the restricted section. Perhaps he'll have an idea. All right, so yeah, we're going we're going to rhinoceros skeleton. That's not a rhinoceros, is it? <laughs> no. Rhinoceros skeleton. Akio. Revelio. Rhinoceros skeleton. Hmm. What the heck is that? That's a human skeleton. Rebellion. Y'all, that has to be a skeleton there. I don't know what to do with it. Lumos. Akio. Incendio. Levioso. Incendio. Hmm. Oh. Oh no, we can't open that. If y'all know what to do with <laughs> with that skeleton, because I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure that has something to do with something. Let's go what downstairs. Are you up to now? Nothing. All right, let's go downstairs and see. Incendio. Let's go in here. Hmm. It's not that way. All right. Yeah, it just bothers me that I feel like it's right underneath my nose. Sebastian, there you are. I was hoping to see you. I was in the three broomsticks after the troll attack and saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow. Not many students have Victor Rookwood's attention. What was that all about? Mm. Seems he's working with Ranrock. And Ranrock is after something I found at Gringotts. Ranrock? And when were you at Gringotts? Professor Fig and I ended up there after the dragon attack. It's quite the tale. Fig had this port key. A port key? To Gringotts? I'm not sure I follow. I barely follow myself, and I was there. Anyway, we ended up in an ancient vault where we found a map. That map leads to the restricted section. I don't know if we you should can't be telling be serious. Sebastian Deadly Hollis. serious. Professor Fig has insisted that I not tell a soul about any of this. But you just I told probably him. Probably said too much. Yes. Understood. Your secret's safe with me. I hope so. Whatever it Sebastian. is. Sebastian. Thank you, Sebastian. You mentioned being clever enough not to get caught in the restricted section. And I am. Meet me outside the library tonight and tell no one. All right, see you tonight. Uh, nah. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll meet you later. All 
all right cool guys i'm gonna cut it off here uh meet me in the next episode i'm, I'm making it right now um i appreciate you guys for for the support it really means a lot to me i love you guys appreciate it